Hi, this is Bob Dickinson. We're going to talk about swim batch running. There's um, actually two different engines in Swim 5 that you can use. One is a Swim 5 DLL, which is used with the Swim 5 GUI, and the other is a Swim 5.exe file, and that's a DOS console model. So um, here's an example DOS um, runner here. Um, this is one I developed for C at CDM, which ran Swim 4 batch files. So you could edit um, the IMP file and what it does is it, it runs this ex um, executable, this input, and makes an output file. So we go ahead and solve it. Let me drag that over there. Runs. This one's a pretty fast model. It runs and we look at the output and we get our report output file. And at the bottom we have um, in the swim DOS, you get a the node, the uh, the link, and the subcatchment time series as text. So you can use that in MATLAB or, other, or some other external file. And the way you do that is if you look at the input file, you run the model with um, <coughs> report, subcatchments all, nodes all, links all, and that does that. Another way to do this is to especially if you're using MATLAB, is to use a DOS batch file. Um, and here's an example here. So it's, it's swim5.exe, the name of the input file, the name of the output file, then pause so we can see what happens. So we go ahead and run that. Drag it over again, same idea, runs pretty fast, and it makes this output file. And here's our output file. Again, with the text output in, in there, which you can use for other things. So that's a little bit about the SWIM um, batch files. So again, a lot of students like to use this with MATLAB or, or for example, for Monte Carlo analysis, and this is how you run the batch file. Thank you for listening.